Hey everybody, uh, I thought I'd take a, a minute to make a video that kind of show you how you can really quickly make a bunch of variants of the kind of base 3MF paint job that I'm including. So uh, let's get started. You grab your individual model that you want to change. You go into this paint tool, color painting tool, and you pick the pick the different colors and the then you pick the fill tool. And you want to turn off edge detection. The way this works is with edge detection on, you can set an angle and it will try and find uh, how to fill in that angle or section based on where this bar is here. If you want it to act as just a bucket fill tool, click off edge detection and now it will automatically want to fill any any complete section of color. So you see as I highlight over these it's showing the entire thing. So how do I make a variation? I'll just click on it. I'll just click one of the colors with a different color and say I want this one to have body color on the top. So I would do that. And I think that's all I'll do on this one, but you can already see how it gives it a different character. For this one, I want to go with a simple one. So I'll make, I'll just fill in a lot of these. I'll take this cream and fill out the dark up here. I'll fill in these side patterning as well. So now it's just a basic kind of two-tone crusty. Uh, for I'm going to clone this one just so that I have the original still. And then I'm going to do for this one, I'll make, I want this part to be body colored instead. And this one, you know, I'll make this one a little more challenging. Say I want this to be cream and I want these dots to be the cream color, but I want the inside to be this dark brown. Since these are already like adjacent and touching each other, if I filled this knowing I want this to be dark brown, I now have just lost that paint job. So you kind of need to use like a, an intermediate color that'll allow you to do the filling in stages. So I'll take the white because I know I'm not using the white anywhere else in the body and I'll click on this section with white. So now, now I can go in with the dark and paint over here and I'm not combining it with what it used to be. Then I can go back to the cream and color the white parts to cream. So now I've got that version. And honestly that white looked kind of cool so maybe I would take the white and do a version like that. Why not? You can do whatever you want. I wonder if this would look good. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Curious. Oh, I think I did one where I actually painted this white and this white. You know, that I like better. Anyways, hopefully that was informative and easy to understand. It's uh, fairly simple and kind of fun. So enjoy.